Brothers and sisters, I'd like to welcome all of you here today. I was planning to come here for one condolence meeting. Unfortunately, now it has become two condolence meetings. Earlier, we lost Moeen Kutiji, a towering leader and personality of the UDF. And now, as you all know, we have lost P.T. Thomas. Both of them were similar type of leaders. UDF leaders, Congress leaders, the main skill is bringing people together. Bringing people from different communities, people from different walks of life, people from different backgrounds, and building a bridge between them. That is what we do. And I think both Mohit Kutiji and P.T. Thomas Ji did this exceptionally well. I had a personal experience with both of them. I was personally very fond of them. So it is not just a work tragedy, it is also a personal tragedy. I have lost two friends, two colleagues. I will speak about Mohit Kutiji first. I met him during my election campaign and I felt that he was always very positive, very supportive, always providing excellent ideas for the campaign, for the people of Kerala, for the people of Vaidam. So it was with a lot of sadness that I heard the news of his passing. As we all know, he was three time MLA and he fought from a very diverse constituency, Thiruvambadi. And his ability, as I mentioned, to bring people together, to make everybody feel part of the same system, part of the same family, was unique. He understood very well that for a place like Kerala, for a place like India to move forward, you need pluralism, you need to build bridges between people. And in a time when many people in our country are breaking the bridges between different communities, are harming the relationship between different communities, he was a beacon of hope, he was a person who was helping strengthen India, strengthen Kerala. Everybody knows his commitment to secularism, so I don't need to repeat it here. I was always drawn by his optimism, never negative, never pessimistic, always hopeful and always optimistic. And so, I remember him with love and affection and I give my love and affection to his family members and all those people who worked with him and who loved him very much. I'll now speak about P.T. Thomas, again a towering personality in Kerala, a personality who guided the Congress party not just at the state level but also at the national level. Again, a person who was deeply committed to the Congress ideology, deeply secular and built bridges between all communities and was loved by all communities in Kerala. I have mentioned today that I am going to cancel my programs in respect of P.T. Thomas Chief, and I will go uh, to Gochen instead of carrying on my program here. Uh, of course, I feel sad that we have lost these two towering personalities. But I know that in the UDF and in the Congress in Kerala, 
There are many, many, many people, more people, with the same spirit, same energy as the two people we have lost. So, I am not pessimistic, I am optimistic, I am hopeful, and I am happy that they showed us the path to walk on, the direction to walk on, and I am confident that the UBF and the Congress Party, both at the Kerala level and at the national level, will continue to do so with favor. Thank you very much for coming here for this meeting. All the best. Namaskar.